Hey, welcome back to the Wolf Hunters channel, y'all. My name is John of the Wolf Hunters, and next to me, a woman so incredibly beautiful, it boggles all of our minds. It is Dolly Hay. And we are here to react to some music for you. If you look beneath this video, you'll see some links in the description box. Go check them out. You could even request your own reaction video. That's right. Some people say that that is a really fun thing to do. <laughs> and I agree with those people. Today's request is brought to us by a man that usually brings us country, but today, something a little different. It is Chris. Chris. And Chris, you're taking us on this really interesting Dio journey. Mm. So we had the first request from the 1960s, which I'm assuming has got to be one of his first projects. Yeah. And now we're taking a look at his last concert with Black Sabbath. Mm. I love how you're bookending this. That's a very interesting move. Let's read the email. It says, Dio in his last concert with Black Sabbath, actually calling themselves Heaven and Hell, months less than a year before stomach cancer took his life. Wow. So really one of the final shows yeah. for Dio. That is amazing. Thank you so much for sharing the significance of that. And of course, you know, we, I didn't really listen to him before he passed, but on mm. behalf of everyone that loves his music, and now, now I know about his music, rest in peace, Ronnie James, yeah. Dio. All right, before we get into this one, we need your help, everybody. If you guys love Dio and Black Sabbath, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, hit that notification bell, and definitely, most assuredly, go ahead and uh, comment below, y'all. All right, let's go. Fifty years. That is wild. Okay, wow. wow. He's having so much fun. Hmm. He's like jumping around, running around, going to the audience. You can just see on his yeah. face, he's having the time of his life, you know? And it's incredible to think, I mean, if a few months later he passed away due to cancer, chances are even now he's feeling it, you know? Yeah. And yet the joy, the pure energy that he has on stage is like, there's nothing wrong with his body at all. Yeah, it's beautiful. You know? That's incredible, dude. Like, that is a true 
person that loves what they do and is completely consumed with yeah. the music. You know, that's amazing. That's incredible. Mm. His voice sounds awesome. So powerful. So controlled. Just ripping, dude. Yeah. Absolutely ripping. And what an incredible band. They just all sound dope. Phenomenal. Phenomenal. Let's go. What? He's dodging stuff? What is that? He's got reflexes. He didn't miss a lyric, he didn't miss nothing, dude. <laughs> what? Amazing performance, dude. The wow. energy. While he's singing the song, to dodge a t-shirt, mm. pick up the t-shirt, display the t-shirt. I couldn't <laughs> even read what it said. Apparently, he didn't like it. He throws it on the ground, like it. kicks it, and he's like, ah, you know? And the crowd went crazy when he yeah. did that. I mean, that is somebody that literally can perform in their sleep, you yeah. know? Somebody who's a master of their craft. Thank you so much, Ooh. Chris for sharing this really interesting bookend journey of Dio's career. That was a really cool idea. Yeah. We enjoyed it. Thank you so much, man. Everybody else, thank you for hanging out with us. If you enjoyed this reaction, hit that subscribe button, and we'll see you again very soon. We love you. Bye. Bye. I just wanna bang my girl.